about a river that does not even run through the city of Vienna. It flows round the outskirts. Today, a gilded statue of Johann Strauss, the Waltz King, stands in the Stadtpark, where every Sunday his music was heard. Do you know, when the score of the beautiful Blue Danube was first published, it was so popular that the printing presses in Vienna wore out. So popular that when Johannes Brahms was asked for his autograph in a restaurant, he wrote the opening bars of the Blue Danube on a napkin with the words underneath, Leider nicht von Johannes Brahms. Sadly, not by Johannes Brahms. I'm John Suchet. I hope you've enjoyed my three-part series on the story of Strauss. It only remains for me to say, as conductor Christian Thielemann and the Vienna Philharmonic will say from the stage of the Musikverein on Sunday morning, wir wünschen Ihnen ein glückliches neues Jahr. And I, John Suchet, wish you a very happy 2024. Now next on Classic FM tonight, 